Good morning, everyone. This is Pioneer Agronomist Tony Zruzen here to talk a little bit about the differences between gray leaf spot or GLS and how to distinguish it from northern corn leaf blight or northern. So like I said in the northern video, this growing season has been backed up, which causes the window of disease infection to widen out, which could potentially be harmful to this corn crop more so than any other year. So when we're looking at the differences in northern and in gray, we want to look at the lesions and the shape that they're in. So let's start with northern. As you're taking a look at these lesions, look to see how they're long, wider, almost cigar looking shapes. Now northern is influenced by cooler temperatures. And a good way to remember that is that as you go north, it's usually cooler. So dedicate that to memory and it'll help with your scouting. Now GLS, or gray leaf spot, tends to be more blocky and not quite as long or wide. But gray is influenced more by warmer temperatures. So our hybrids are ra rated separately for these two diseases, and we need to take that into consideration when looking at fungicide applications. You may have a hybrid that is strong on northern and weak on gray or vice versa. So we need to know what we're scouting for, what hybrids need to be scouted, and when fungicide applications need to be implemented. So I hope this was helpful. If you've got any questions, please feel free to reach out to me or your Pioneer sales rep. And I hope you have a great day. Thank you. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.